The difference between you as an adult is you'll whinge a bit, you'll swear, you'll carry on. As a child, the only way you have to express those feelings is crying. So when we push them out of their comfort zone, they are going to get upset. Um, what you've got to look at is why they're crying. Okay? If they're crying um, because they're getting pushed out of their comfort zone, that's tolerable. If they're crying because we're doing something bad to them, everything we do is in small increments mm. and everything's about positive reinforcement. Mm. So some kids will not settle down. Some kids, it's about the parents' reaction as well. So if you're on the side of the pool and you're, a, you know, you're struggling watching your child cry and your child knows that, they'll cry more yeah. just to get your attention. No different to if they want a chocolate at home yeah. and you don't want to give them one, but they're going to find a way around that. So, exactly. you know, look, on average, I'd say it's two to three weeks that kids start to settle down. Yep. Okay. But again, every kid's different. We, yeah. As I said, we've had kids cry for one lesson. You know, some kids, we've had a few, a handful, don't cry at all. Yep. So... It's possible that kids go through the program hardly crying at all, um, but it just depends on them and what they've come from and how their parents react to yeah. it. So there's a number of factors there. Yeah. With regard.